To solve for the means and interpret, we need to know the level of preference for this particular data and then we need to identify the number of variables. So for this one, there are two variables and variable number one has indicate seven indicators, variable number two has eight indicators. So how do we solve for the mean? We need to solve the means per indicator. So we are going to start with B9 and then stop at B208. So this is your mean. Just to use the average formula. Remember that it starts at B9 and ends with B208. Now you have your mean for indicator 1.1 and to get the means of the other indicators all you need to do is just drag it to the right to observe uniformity you need to make sure that you are going to um, use two decimal places for each means okay so the next step will be to open another sheet because we are going to need that Okay, so copy the information from sheet 1 and then transpose the information here using paste special. Now remember that we do not need the formulas, we only need the values. So we are going to transpose, click OK when you're done. Now these are individual answers of the respondents and we do not need them. So we need to delete. These are the mean. Now, the last step will be to interpret each mean. Now, remember that there are two indicators. So we, we are going to need the overall mean per, indica uh, per variable. Sorry, I mean to say there are two variables. And we need to get the overall mean per variable. So how do we do that? Still use the average formula. Okay. Now back to the old sheet, we will need this for the interpretation. So this is 1, 1 1.75, 2.5, 3 3.26. How do we interpret the mean? We are going to use the VLOOKUP. So this is your lookup value. These are your table of arrays. Here's two. Okay, enter okay. and drop it down. Now you have your interpretations. Okay, so how do we interpret that? For variable number one, the overall mean is 2.68, which means it is preferred for variable number two it has an overall mean of 2.34 which means it is less preferred this is how you're going to get the mean and then interpret thank you